Hey guys, what's going on? It's Exit the Smokes here, and welcome back to part three of our fairy tale let's play. I was about to say Monster Hunter. No, this is not Monster Hunter. This is fairy tale. This is definitely 100% fairy tale. So, in the last episode, we did two requests, um, and we got Wendy and Gray as friends, so we can use them here when we go into fights now. Um, and then we learn about bonding events as well. And we're about to do our very first bonding event, I assume, with Lucy. And hopefully I can take on that request afterwards, because I really want to. Damn it. Anyway, uh, let's character rank up, because we got two. We need 40 for that. Oh, sweet. Anyway. Um... Yep, rank Lucy up. We get another magic chain enhance. And Okay, that's pretty funny. I like that they included that because Grey has like a for the second star there. Cause it says Master's teaching speed. When attacked, five percent chance of close coming off and raising speed by 10% for the remainder of the battle. That's funny because Grey has that has the habit of like randomly stripping. Um, so I like that they included that. That's quite funny. Okay, critic raise critical rate by 30% while awakened. Damn. Okay, and then Lucy's is celestial, prote uh, celestial protection. HP cannot be reduced below one when taking damage while HP is at 30% or higher. That's mad. And then Wendy's is Extends buff skin by Wendy by one turn. Cool. Okay, now, uh, let's... Because I'm using Wendy anyway. Let's rank Wendy up. Nice. That's what we want. Now, let's go. Yeah, we're going to do our first bonding event. Hey Lucy, wanna get some food? Sorry, not today. I barely have enough money for rent as it is. Huh? How'd that happen? Money lives somewhere way more expensive than you, but she has no problem paying. I, I know that. You don't need to rub it in my face. How do, you How do you always run out of money? I never have trouble. And we make the same since we, since we always work together. Well, if you must know, it's because you're always breaking things. Do you realize how much of my rent money I lose because of that? Sorry. Yeah, that's Natsu's thing. He, he, he's kind of like Gildarts where he doesn't really hold back a lot, and he just ends up destroying quite a bit of property. It's okay. I'm not mad at you or anything. Besides, I like working with you. It's very reassuring. Really? Yeah. So just don't go too crazy, okay? Yay! Raises magic chains, chain rate! Woo woo! Let's yes. go! Alright, time for the next request. Let's go! So now that's the reason we couldn't do it. Get the mailman. It's a subdue quest. Oh, so they're teaching us about different kinds of quests. Okay. Help. I was delivering the post in the Grand Plains and the bandits took everyone's mail. You have to get it back. Oh, we get a wizard lacrim out of this as well, nice. We're probably going to get Urza for this one. A robbery, huh? Terrible. There's poor people waiting for their packages and letters. This is unforgivable. This seems bad. I will join you. It's only a D rank quest, Urza. You don't really need to do for this. Urza, is this such a big deal that you need to come to? Or is this such a big deal you need to come to? Well, my... Never mind. I can't let wrongdoings go punished. I'll fucking take Urza on the team. I'll 100% take Urza on the fucking team. <laughs> I'm sorry, Wendy, but if we have like, if we, if we still only have three slots, then uh, Urza's gonna have to take your place. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Our enemies may be few, but they're still members of a dark guild. Be careful. We're seven years out of practice, but don't worry if you're hit. We'll, don't worry. Well, we won't worry. Whatever. Wait, message dog. Here we go. 
We're seven years out of practice, but we don't need to worry if you're here. There we if there was this, then, we then I don't have to hold back. I finally give it my all. You never hold back. Hopefully we won't be in the red again after you destroy everything. You worry too much, Lucy. Can't set their attacks in the Great Plains. Hooah, let's go. Wait, hang on. Bang. Place, I wonder if you can. I wonder if you can just go to the, uh, uh like the boundary forest, uh, and the Great Plains just to explore, like grind and stuff. Because that would be pretty cool. Hmm. This person who took our stuff is close by. Be ready. They're just over there, so we've got to go the long way around. Gotcha, bitch. Let's do this. Speed up. Oh, they're weak to that shit. Okay, hang on. Bang. Go. Nice. Nice. Bent claw. Nice. Probably use that. I think those are ingredients, aren't they? Let's have a look. Oh yeah, they can use to make lacrimas as well. Lovely. Water. Ooh, there's nothing there. There should be. <laughs> anyway. Huh? When you're outside of town, entering a battle near fallen trees or boulders will cause the objects to be included in the battle. There's a fallen tree back there. I wonder if I can deal. I wonder if I can deal with it and these enemies at the same time. Hmm. Looks like it's going to take more than just a single hit. Guess that means we need to go all out. I'm all fired up now. Okay. Kind of a bit overkill on one enemy, but alright. Here we go. Fire Dragon, brilliant flame. Over damage. <laughs> when you when your total damage exceeds the set amount exceeds the set amount, over damage will activate and the object will be destroyed. Tail. Nice. Level three. When you're outside of town, entering a battle near a fallen tree or border will cause the object to be included in battle. Okay, so that's kind of what we just saw. However, damage will open up block pass and allow hidden items to be found. Oh, hell yes. I mean, that's not hidden item, but still. Chest! What we got? 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 Energy lacrima. What the hell does that do? Let me have a look. No, lacrima. There we go. Oh, hello. I'll give that to Gray. Why not? There's a chest there as well. Oh, okay, so when... Oh, so if you tap them from behind, they get... Um, you get, like, a stat increase. Okay, cool. I'll take that. Use that fire dragon roll. Nice. More bent claws. 
Small bottled Ethan in it. Oh, that probably restores MP. That's a good thing. Nice. More Grandma Heart members. I, I found it. My cute and I mean, let's return everything at once. Cute? Huh? You don't know Dark's gonna get it. Let's go. Get him, Natsu. I think they're supposed to be like standard Dark Guild people, but that the emblem on their back is actually. Um, or oh, you see the emblem. That's um, Grimma Hot's uh, sigil. Oh, actually, no. Because I can. Because it hit all of them. Oh, break as well. Nice. Over damage! Fire Dragon War, these bastards. And as a one-shotting people, that makes sense. Considering she's like... She's arguably the strongest female wizard in Fairy Tale. Blows who wish to be cut down, step forward. There we go, these two. Nice. Just a regular attack. Yay, small ball Ethan Nanos as well. I'm pretty sure they were, they um 30,000 or more. God damn. Oh, that was just this one. I'll see if I can lure these guys up here, because I want to know what's up here. What the hell is that over there? Wait, you, come on. Follow me. Oh, you... Come on. That's going to take ages, fuck it. I thought I'd see if I can go that. Anyway. I need to check. Yeah, yeah, I thought it was. Oh, yeah. I was just pretty sure it was. Actually, bang again. That's really useful as well. They're just buffing themselves, okay. I have to use one of those small uh, Ethan and a bot bottles on Lucy. Nice. Um. Yeah, just to restore Lucy's MP a bit. Gonna save that for a bit later. I don't know if I use that. I can't, actually, no, I can't hit three of them. Okay, fair enough. Summon Scorpio. I like how they don't have, like, character models for any of the, uh... Oh, what do you call it? Any of the Celestial Spirits. That's fine. Doesn't bother me that much. Dun 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 dun! Phew, that was the last of them. All the mail is safe. Huh? Here's all. What's that? Oh, this. This is my package. Are the contents okay? Nothing's broken, is it? It's fine. It's not something easily broken. Uh, is it? The package is ripped. Something's coming out of the hole. Underwear? Um, it may be underwear, but it's definitely not cute. Just regular practical underwear. Oh, so that's what the cute and... huh. We'll report back at once. No, because I want to explore a bit more. 
There's a chest right around the crap that. That's why we battled again, so we can get level 4. Torn hide, nice. Poison Lacrima? What's that? Give that one to Wendy, you know. 10% chance of infecting poison. Enemies attack. Slightly less due to less likely to inflict poison. Oh, nice, cool. That's that's a mermaid. It smells like something strong's waiting for us on the other side of the river. I'm fired up. That sounds scary. Be careful not to. Oh, yeah, it's those. Those are the same beasts. Oh my god, okay. You know what? That is. That is exactly Elfman's Beast Soul takeover form. I'm not kidding, that's actually Elfman's Beast takeover form. Fuck it. Nice. Mega Fire Dragon Iron Fist. Trinity Swords. Summon Ares. Nice. Might have been a waste of the magical chamber, hey. I was not taking that chance. Oh, she's learning Trin Trinity Swords now. That's good. I think we're going to head back. Yeah, that might be the best thing, just to head back right now. Can we... No, okay, so we have to literally go to the exit, okay. Delicious candy. Nikora loves candy. If you have some, head over to Lucy's house and give them to Nikora. I'm going to call him Clue because that's exactly what he's called. Uh, depending on how many you give him, you may see a roll. But okay, cool. Let's go! Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. I've got a wizard luck come off. That increases strength. And we get Urza, I assume. Oh, wait a minute. Hang on. Seems as though everyone's had their mail returned. Thank goodness. Mail can have some real important, one kind of, one of a kind things in it. And it always feels good when someone comes in, something comes in the mail, even if you're the ones who ordered it. <laughs> yes, I'm also happy we completed this mission. I didn't get anything. I'll send you some fish since I'm happy. Yay! No, it really does deliver happiness. You both live in the same house. Oh, did get up. Hey, Lucy, got a minute? Hmm, Calm's calling me. I wonder what's up. We changed to Lucy. Cool. There's no requests. Oh, we did get Urza. So Tanya Zenith. Raises attack and defense when 10, by 10% 10 when Hazebe is at 30% or lower. Okay, that's pretty good. Nice. 
Yeah, that's that was those are in a heaven's wheel armor. That's just her standard armor as well. I think it's called Heart Crux. Or Heart Croix. One of the two. Anyway. We are gonna to talk to Connor in the next episode. So for a quick recap, we uh, did the bonding event with Lucy and then we also went on another quest um, to a new place, the uh, Great Plains that was it, and then we learned about over damage and destroying uh, objects in the background, if they are, if they're destructible objects in the background due to over damage, um, and yeah. That's really it. And now in the next, and as I say in the next episode, we're going to be talking to Connor and finding out what we sh what she wants, and just continuing on with the story. So, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure to hit that like button. If you are enjoying uh, Fairy Tale Let's Play, make sure to subscribe as well because I'm going to have so much fun let's playing this for you guys. It's going to be so much fun. Um, also, please be sure to check out my Treasure Cold Steel 2 Let's Play. Um, and also, if you guys are a fan of JRPGs or just RPGs in general, make sure to subscribe as well because hey, that's what I do here. Um, as I said in every episode, and I'll have one project in the work lines up um, that will be. I will uh, begin to record it once I have finished uh, Treasure Cold Steel 2. So look forward to that. Um, or look out for that, I should say. Um, but I was going to say, but if I can't record, I know I can. Uh, but with all that PSA out of the way, this is X30 Smarks, and I shall see you guys next time.